talked to you what, a couple weeks ago yeah. when the window opened. How differently do you feel now than when we when we spoke to you and, and you said you kind of need to get your legs under you? Um, I'm just feeling a lot better every week. I've I've seen a big jump just in confidence in the way I'm moving, and uh, this week's you know the same. Uh, just really happy to be out there and and happy for the opportunity. Is it wild? Is it's kind of ironic. Trey, one year almost from his injury now almost a year away from yours. Was this kind of your timeline here to say, okay, I, th I think let, let's get this back within a year? Yeah, I mean, in my head for sure. Um, a, lot of a lot of prayers um, and just really felt like this was going to be about the time from way back. I, I told, you know, Joe Meek in, in the training room, like I'd really like to be back by Christmas and just so happened to work out about perfectly and I, I couldn't be happy, happier with how it's feeling. It seems like your time here has kind of been like a – Seizing an opportunity when, you know, unfortunately it seems to pop if someone goes down. It kind of seems like you're in that same position here this week. It, do, do you kind of see the timing, you know, unfortunately with Mitch or whatever, the timing almost perfect for the team? I mean, yeah, I'm just I'm taking it one day at a time, and I'm trying to get myself ready if the team needs me, and, and that's really my mindset. You know, I'm not, you know, planning on anything. I'm just I'm just taking it one day at a time, and if my number's called, I'll be, I'll be ready to go. How big of a mental yeah, it's you know a challenge every day. It's been a challenge every day just to keep that that drive and that that hunger alive, just with it being so long. But you know, I've got a, a super su supportive family, and I have a strong faith, and that's really helped me. And to be honest, once my 21-day uh, period got activated, I was like, I don't know, it almost seemed like yesterday that it went really fast, really fast to me. So you know, it was a grind, but. I, I learned a lot about myself and, uh, you know, my family, like I said, was my, my wife especially was super supportive and she really stepped up and, and took care. I was, said I was our third child this year. <laughs> so uh, she had three kids instead of two this year. So she, she did a great job. Can you shed any light on what you learned about yourself? Because a, a year away from what you do, I mean, that's a, that's a lot. Yeah, I mean, I would just say I really – one, number one, how much I miss football and, and being out there with the guys. I have been in – my wife said it uh, last week. She's like, you're in such a better mood. I'm like, yeah, because I'm, I'm back to doing what I love to do. And uh, just being back out there with the guys at practice has been has been awesome. And just the energy I wake up with every morning, uh, it's just different. So I'd say that. And then just, you know, that determination and, and what it takes to come back from an injury like this. And – I think going through it once already, you know, my senior year in college really helped. Um, but I'm hoping that this is the, the end of those. So I haven't really had any other, other injuries besides Achilles. So I guess it's my Achilles heel, but I'm, I got them out the way. Rep, rep to rep when you're back out on there in the practice field, especially in the team stuff, what are the biggest challenges or what have you noticed about like, oh, this isn't the same that it was before? Honestly, nothing. I feel, you know, significantly stronger just from all the time I've spent in the weight room. I'd say the biggest thing for me right now is just catching back up to the speed. Mm -hmm. um, but that's coming. That's coming coming along very nice. And, you know, that first week back out, I was like, either these people got way faster or I slowed down. But, you know, week four now, I don't feel that way at all. So, you know, I'm happy, happy to see that. I feel like a lot of guys around here are called Stallion. Yeah. But I, I feel like you might have been the first one to be called that. Is that true? I, I think I might have brought that brought that to that. the Bills a few years How ago. How did that originate? Uh, they, guys in college just called me that, and I just think it's a good compliment to give guys. So started calling people it and caught on. That's awesome. Yeah.